how did you go about as far as developing this character for this film? I studied um, the words of real survivors mm. of domestic abuse. I met with survivors. I spent time at a shelter in right. New York City. I tried to learn as much as I could. I wanted to be as authentic as I could be in this portrayal. I take that so seriously. And um, that was my real preparation. Physically, I had to prepare to fight. Right. And that was its own extensive process. But the most important thing was to listen to survivors. Now, as far as the fighting scenes, the action scenes, like how challenging were they? And, and were there any specific scenes that kind of were difficult for you to create? They were really challenging. I, I really appreciated how our director, Sarah Dagger Nixon, didn't want to kind of fetishize violence in any way. Right. So my character was purposefully designed to fight in a very efficient way efficient way. It wasn't about like torturing and hurting and bleeding and all those things. It was about like kill shots. And so those fighting scenes were all about precision and efficiency. And the hardest is this, the character trains very hard in the scene. She trains on her own. And so I had to do a lot of scenes where I was doing like a thousand sit-ups and push-ups and stuff. And I'm not very good at that. <laughs> and I had just had a kid. So I was like, I was just really yeah, trying to get back on track. <laughs> right. Now, aside from this, you're also about to drop your, you're going to make your directorial debut. Made it. So, it's coming out. you know, how much of a challenge was that for you? Oh, it was uh, the most challenging and most gratifying experience of my life. Yeah. Well, congratulations. Thanks Thank for you. hanging out with me.